Welcome back. This is episode, I think, four. In episode one, we um, defined the college type. We set the precedent for our project. In episode two, uh, we made some modifications and prompted AI to improve the code and take it to the next step. Uh, that next step re revolved heavily on Redux. In episode three, we talked about Redux and how I have Redux set up in this project. In this episode, we're going to talk about what it did um, the code that goes along with episode three and the Redux explanation. So again, we asked Redux to, cr to, to create an add, excuse me, college button. This add college button is going to open up this college modal. This college modal is a form, a form which allows me to specify the name, the address, the phone number, and the motto of the school. When I press save, this is going to do some validation. We don't want to store a, a college without a name. It's going to then add that college to Redux, which again is our local database. And an external or backend database is like Firebase, Superbase, and whatever else, Postgres, and whatever else you use. This add college action is an action on um, the colleges slice, which is a dump slice that we have, which again is just an object of key value pairs. This is just going to go ahead and, and, and slide in a, a, a college using that id so it also we actually don't even need this update um it's the same it's the same concept um, so once we create that we should then see it on the main page here so i'm going to go ahead and do that go back to our app this is the idea that we're building by the way so we got localhost 3000 we'll press add college that shows this modal matt's school uh trout house tech one, two, three, four. It's a random phone number. Okay, the phone number is not formatted. We can fix that. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, four. Um, feed the hood. When I press add that college, we can see that it's here. Right? There's our phone number, there's the motto, and everything like that. Again, it goes from modal. It goes from modal to Redux. And then wherever in the application care, wherever the application cares about colleges, it just grabs it from Redux. And this is not the most efficient in terms of like usages and stuff like that, but um, it's the general, general concept. Um, it's cool. In the next video, we'll refine this table some, we'll add some phone formatting, talk about some util files, um, and also persist the data so that when I refresh, it's still there. So thanks for watching.